When your laptop's battery level starts hitting the red zone, it's time to whip out the charger and plug it in. But what if nothing happens? Let's look at what you can do when your laptop is not charging even though the charger is plugged in. The first thing you should always do is to double check the connection. Check that the charger is plugged into the wall, that the power switch is on, that the power cable is securely inserted into the brick, and that the laptop is properly plugged in as well. While you're at it, check these components for signs of damage or fraying. If you see exposed wire or damage, desist from trying to charge the laptop and replace the damaged components first. Oh, and this might sound really stupid, but make sure there's actually electricity. Check your circuit breaker to see whether the outlets are working. If all of that checks out, the next step is to remove your battery. If your laptop is actually plugged in and not charging or it's not switching on, the battery might actually be the culprit. If it is removable, take it out and press and hold down the power button for around 15 seconds. This will drain the last remaining power from your laptop. Then plug in your laptop's power cable and turn the device on without reinserting the battery. This is one way you can tell if there's something wrong with your power adapter or if the battery is the issue. If you don't have a removable battery in your laptop, however, your only option is to take it in for testing by a professional. A laptop that refuses to charge isn't usually something that the typical user can fix, and batteries inevitably wear out. Sadly, many modern laptops don't have a user removable battery, and some even have their batteries glued in. So even if you could crack open the case, you'd need special solvents and tools to get the battery out. Then you have to convince someone to sell you a new battery that's not meant for user replacement. The good news is that it shouldn't be too expensive to get your battery replaced, and if you're still within the laptop's warranty period, it shouldn't cost you anything at all. Remember to check the article linked in the description below for a few more things you could try if your laptop isn't charging. See you next time.